How's it going, University of Utah? My name is Ian Hazel. I'm going to be giving you today's forecast, July 30th, 2015. We're going to start with the lows for today. And as you can see, we're still running a little low thanks to that cold front that happened earlier this week. Uh, we are finally getting up into the 60s. As you can see at the University of Utah in Sandy, that's where that happened. 62 at the U, 61 in Sandy. We got up to 58 downtown. Uh, West Valley is at 55 as well as Bountiful. As for our current temperatures, you can see we're about in the mid-70s across the board. 74 at the U and Bountiful right now. 77 downtown is our highest current temperature. 75 in West Valley and 76 in Sandy. Looking at the camera at the top of the William Browning building here on campus, you can see that it's a very clear day. Uh, no clouds really. We're starting to see some haze develop and that's going to be a continuing trend into the weekend. We'll talk about that in a minute. For right now, let's take a look at the Valley UCAST. Again, as you can see, hazy today across the valley. Temperatures, highs are pretty much right around the upper 80s to 90. 90 at the U, 90 downtown, and in Sandy, you can see we get up to 89 in West Valley and 88 in Bountiful. So. Uh, plan for a little bit higher than yesterday and the day before and that's going to kind of continue into the weekend as well as far as what to expect. We're going to see plenty of sunshine and then that haze we saw earlier, again that sunshine is going to kind of play into that a bit with more sun and with warmer temperatures we're going to get more ozone so expect that moderate haziness potentially getting up into unhealthy for sensitive groups and again temps rising well into the 90s across the board. So taking a look at the campus five-day forecast again you can see what we talked about earlier with the temperatures. Uh, we start up here today at 90 and then we get to 92, 93, 95 will be our highest over the weekend before dipping a little bit down to 94 on Monday. You can also see the air quality index starting to rise up over the weekend from moderate into unhealthy. It does get back to good on Monday, so that'll be nice. As far as precipitation chances go, we're not going to really see much over the weekend. 20% on Sunday is about as high of a chance as you're going to see. 30% on Monday, but as far as outdoor activities this weekend go, it's looking pretty good. You know, whether you're going to go camping or if you're studying for finals up here at the U and you just need a quick break to get outside, this is a really good weekend to do it. Highly recommend that. So, once again, my name is Ian Hazel. Today is Thursday, July 30th. Thank you for tuning in to Ute Weather.